Well, hello to everybody. Welcome to our coverage of the first day of the competition. Hello, and welcome it may to be an match. overused phrase, but uh, everyone really does start out equal on this day. Stature and reputation and history all irrelevant, albeit momentarily. This is the game everybody, no matter who they support, can be just a little bit hopeful about. Maybe it's their turn, just maybe. And the mood is boisterous. It is a perfect ambience for the central characters who are ready now to perform. Things have got on the way here pretty promptly. And it's Cancelo. Kimmich. And he has been fouled there. So, power or guile, what's it going to be? A real opportunity here from a position of great potential. Away from immediate danger. Kimmich has ended all speculation on his future and chosen to stay put. Now it's Kimmich. Well, that looks a foul. Yep, referee's given it. Yeah, well, they were exposed and, and vulnerable, and he knew he had to do something to prevent a goal then. There could be trouble here, but for now the referee is keeping his cards in his pocket. And a real chance to break the deadlock. Great chance here from position A1. Back into the middle. Challenge just a bit on the firm side. And he's there to belt it away. They've got to be quick moving this forward. Referee's given a throw. Tries a shot! Knocks it away. And he's there to retrieve it. Italy are seeing more of the ball, but still aren't carrying much goal threat. Kimmich. Oh, easy pickings there. And here's Neymar. And that's been intercepted. That's just playing it safe and simple. Borja Baston. Out to the right. It'll be a throw in. Neymar spread neatly oh well played well sorted out and that is as far as they're going to go it's a pretty loose pass Kimmich Schau Cancelo Mbappe goes in for the header He's got away with one there. That's just front foot enforcement. Pressure leads to mistake, leads to chance. Referee's had a look, and he's blown his whistle for half-time. Well, perhaps not full of thrills and spills, but a game which has been of a very high level, certainly defensively, as both teams walk off unscathed. A tight affair, nil-nil at the break. Any opinion you'd like to express on the first half? I think it's been a very impressive defensive effort. They've never been broken down and contained the opposition attack extremely well. 
And after 45 minutes, it is still goalless. A change, perhaps, after half-time. We're promptly into the second 45 minutes. Italy playing well with lots of opportunities and plenty positives to take from the first half. Despite this scoreline, converting chances would make a world of difference for them. He's got away. He's under a lot of pressure there. Played out towards the right wing. No, it's not getting there. Messi. Still absolutely nothing to report here, goals wise. The attendance for this and there's his chance to lead the counter. He is just caressing the ball. Alexander Arnold. Rice. Walker Baston. De Ligt wins the duel this time. Now it's Mohamed Salah. That's a modern defender's instinct from a, a modern coach's mindset. And here's Messi. And he's quick to get it clear again. And they're quick to get it back. Played back in. Pinches it off him. Now it's Messi. And here's Mohamed Salah. Oh, now here's an interesting matchup. Rice. Don't you just love the level of intensity here? Neither is prepared to back down, and, and to be honest, that's how it should be. He steps in, and that's the end of that. And it's Messi. And here's Neymar. João Cancelo has it in a wide position. Kivik. Now it's Mbappe. Mbappe! Oh, and they really should have been made to pay. Well, one sloppy lapse like that can do a lot of damage, and it was triggered by the closing down. Substitution for Italy, number nine, Neymar. So, time for changes Coming on, on both sides, actually. Number well, Peter, I don't think there's anything tactical or injury-related here. I think it's just all about the push for a goal now. Cazola. Well, Borja Baston, looking for the runner. Well, played right into his path. Oh, no joy this time. There will be one minute added time. They're avoiding the blatantly obvious by not getting the ball into the opposition box. That's where it has to be. And there goes the final whistle. And stalemate. One, if not for fans, then perhaps for coaches. Satisfied by organisation and solidity. Little cutting edge at either end. And it finishes nil-nil. How would you summarise what we've seen today then, Jim? Well, if this was a game where both sides played to their strengths... Well, good evening to you and welcome on this most perfect evening for a Hello game of football to which we look forward match. immensely. It's hardly a surprise that everybody has come here in their droves, this being a fixture that has received so much coverage in the days leading up to it. And it's good to see that we have a good contingent of visiting fans by the look of it too. The atmosphere is amicable, the conditions do bring out the best in everyone, and I think we're all looking forward to a feel-good game. This place is living up to its reputation as one of the noisiest corners of the footballing world. No decibel spared in this collective chorus. The action has already started. Kimmich. Another throw in. And it's Neymar. And he's there to clear it. Chance to break. Looking for the runner. He's left his man. 
In the end, they found themselves penned in, nowhere to go. This is the time you need that pace. He's found a way through. Well, it looked promising, but the final ball is just not quite right. Gets away from his opponent. Well, he is the type of character who rises to this sort of challenge, and he will be back for more. Oh, good spread. Now it's Rice. Rice, threads one in, Salah, he's shifting through the gears here. Looks for the finish. The crowd reaction tells you just how close that was. Oh, and it's such a good effort, and maybe the target really should have been hit. Driving forward, out to the right. Ball's gone out of play. And it's Salah. Final ball not quite right, and his teammates are irritated at that. Gets his pass away. You can never be short of runners into space, as long as the space left behind is filled. He is through, has a goal! It's there! And right on half-time, that is telling! The lightness of step, the sharpness of movement, the certainty of finish. Yeah, and having the thrust to get there is one thing, having the composure to score is another number 17 There's the end of the first half. So the end of the first half, both teams have had their moments. There's been no shortage of talking points, but there has been just one goal. And that is the state of it at the break. 1-0. Well, they definitely won't be happy with that half. They seem to lack a bit of desire, especially going forward. It wouldn't surprise me to see a change or two. And we're already back on the way here. The referee's awarded a free kick. Mbappe. Now it's Mohamed Salah. Looking for options for movement. Oh dear, less said about that pass, the better. Mbappe. Messi. And that is expertly dealt with. And he's gone looking for safety.
No foul, says the referee. Clears it out of harm's way. The attendance for this match was 72,000. Final ball not quite right, and his teammates are irritated at that. So, what can they make of this? And it's messy. Bit of a communication breakdown there, it seems. And he's there to belt it away. Substitution on the field. Number 10. Coming on to replace him is number 38. And the pass is intercepted. It's a good run down the right. And he cuts out the supply. Oh, he's going to be disappointed with that. And now the breakaway. Neymar. Kimmich. Well, he certainly wasn't in the mood to take any risks. That's a throw. Substitution on the field. Number 17. Number 14. Coming on the field. Number Kimmich. 8. Number 9. Substitution in progress. Kimmich really struggling to influence the game. They're just trying to negate his influence, and it looks like whatever it takes. Haaland. Italy really might just end up kicking themselves after that. That could well have been it. Over to the left, and he was quick to react. There's a real appetite from them to finally put this game to bed, but will they? And he's been shifted off it. Alexander-Arnold picks it up out wide. He's got away! Italy have a simple task to find something sustained now and keep the pressure on. Two shin to shin, bicep to bicep, and he wins out. Arch been intercepted. He is through here. Played out to the left flank, and he's had it nicked away. And that's that. Always in the balance, and in the end, one goal was enough. They are narrowly beaten. So, Jim, how do you reflect on what we've seen? Well, the way the manager has stormed down the tunnel lends itself to an almighty to telling off for such a, like a timid, docile display. CCTV is now in operation for Many thanks safety. to Jim, and with that... Well, a very warm welcome to you on this most pleasantly clear Hello, evening. Everybody. Conditions absolutely beautiful. Perfect for the beautiful game. Temperatures are kind as well. No doubt playing a hand in high attendance levels as well as an elevated level of anticipation here. Surely this is the hot ticket going around in this neck of the woods. It surely must be. Mbappe! Oh, he's really drilled it. Mbappe. Engages and forces him off the ball. And it's Salah. Mohamed Salah. Now it's Mbappe. And Mbappe! Goal, Italy! And Italy score first. Well, we've seen the hunger to win it back and the focus to make it count. A very tasty combination. The goal scorer for Italy after 13 minutes is number 11, Kylian Mbappe. Italy breakthrough nice and early, just as they wanted it. De Ligt cuts out the pass. Oh, quality clearly deserted him at the crucial moment. 
Yeah, the idea was right. The delivery wasn't. They can revisit that further on. Jao Cancelo. And if you have just joined us, still just one goal between them. And the score is 1-0. Did well to step in there, that was more than necessary. Out to the right, back into the middle. Shifted upfield. Neymar will not want to lose out here, not against this opponent. Jao Cancelo with the foul. It's a quick one. He's in space and looking for options. Good read, needed to be. They've got to make this nice and quick. And that interception was most necessary. Rudiger gets over and intercepts. Mohamed Salah, who does have an assist to his name. Oh, the ball's come loose here. Gets good distance on it. Xiao Cancelo. Rudiger. Alexander-Arnold. Whistle's gone, that's a uh, foul. Rice. There will be one minute added time. Alexander Arnold. And it's Salah. Well, that pass isn't the best. And we've reached half time. So the end of the first half, both teams have had their moments. There's been no shortage of talking points, but there has been just one goal. And that is the state of it at the break. 1 0. What have we learned from the first 45 minutes? Peter, this is far from a lost cause. Yes, they've been hit once by a, a pacey opposition, but they've asserted more control and, and look capable. Italy leading 1-0 at the break. We're promptly into the second. It's Neymar! And he's taking no chances there. And here's Neymar. Now there's a fine... Mohamed Salah! He is desperate to get on the score sheet, but not this time. Italy really are in the ascendancy here, and they know they have to register while that's the case. Italy with the corner, there first. Neymar with the short one. Chance! Just not quite happening for him just now. Italy really putting a few chances together here. Taking one can only add to such good momentum now. Kimmich. Messi. Over to the left. That was good alertness. Mohamed Salah. He's found a way through. He's got the shot away. Oh, the ball's run loose here. The attendance for this match was 72,306. Mbappe. He's had a fair tumble under that challenge. It's a pretty loose pass. And he skips past his man. And the keeper's got it again. Well, it's good stuff. This is better. 
They're coming again and again. Spot on, Peter. Jao Cancelo. And he was quick to react. Mbappe, oh, shooting chance! Oh, that was nice, but not quite the end product required. Well, there are a few pockets of space that are being exploited, and they need filling, and fast. Uh, that's been intercepted. Alexander-Arnold. And it's Messi. Neymar. They've managed to get it away. Oh, and that is really good tenacity. Substitution on the field. Number 11. Number 19. Have their second corner number now. Number 25. Coming on the field. Number They've 23. played it short. Number Messi. 14. Number 2. Substitutions taking place. Alexander Arnold. It is just a question of running down the clock now. I think it's time for them to concentrate on closing this one there out. There will be one minute added time. And that's it. Italy, hold on. It's a narrow squeak, bit of luck, some judgment. 1 0 the score at the final whistle. Mbappe picking up the Man of the Match award, and no surprise there. How do you look back on the game then, Jim? Well, that was a hard-fought win with a defensive masterclass. They backed up their goal with a, a resilience. Well, a very warm welcome to you on this most pleasantly clear evening. Conditions absolutely beautiful. Perfect for the beautiful game. Temperatures are kind as well. No doubt playing a hand in high attendance levels as well as an elevated level of anticipation here. Surely this is the hot ticket going around in this neck of the woods. It surely must be. Such scenes here. A sea of team colours, songs ringing down from the stands. The tone is set for the 90 minutes ahead. The action has already started. That's a throw, and here's Mohamed Salah. Mohamed Salah is flagged offside. Jim, who do you reckon is pivotal? This guy, Donnarumma, is a, a real phenomenon. You'd have to be pretty special to come into top-flight football at the age of 16 and stay there ever since. He's, he's blessed with a, a real physical presence. He's going for goal! Magnificent! Oh, it really is a finish of the highest order! The breakthrough strike! Well, there's always a chance of being caught like that when you surrender the football. The goal for Italy after 15 minutes is number eight. An early launch just as they wanted, just as they hoped it. Over to the left, Raul Moro. Referee's given a throw. And he's being shifted off it. Spread out to the left. Oh, he's played real chance! Well, that is remarkable. 
Oh, look, I don't want to sound too dismissive, but from here, that looks the harder thing to do. Rice. Italy are enjoying a good spell right now and leading. Now Neymar. And if you have just joined us, still just one goal between them. And the score is 1-0. He is through here. Well, he had a really good run at goal there, but the defence just weren't going to let him past. Gently done. And no, that is pretty much the end of that. Escudero. Now he's off and running. Messi. Well, the score's only 1-0, but that doesn't tell the full story. Kimmich, and it's Salah. For Rice. Alexander-Arnold. Oh, it's a promising build-up, there's plenty of really nice passing. And it's Cancelo. Ivan Sanchez. There will be one minute added time. Messi. And here's Mohamed Salah. And there's the end of the first half. So the end of the first half, both teams have had their moments. There's been no shortage of talking points, but there has been just one goal. And that is the state of it at the break. 1-0. What have we learned from the first 45 minutes? Italy clearly are benefiting from their homework. They've dealt with anything that's been thrown at them and have been smart on the break. Italy head in, having made the crucial breakthrough. And to that end, there is a degree of satisfaction there. The lead by no means decisive yet, but so far, so good. 1-0 at the break. And if you're just back from your break, you've missed very little of the resumption of the second half. Italy going well here, and they're in a good position to kick on and add to their lead. They don't have to overcommit but they can place more emphasis on stretching their advantage without necessarily neglecting things defensively. Oh dear, less said about that pass, the better. Alexander-Arnold, and it's Messi, threads one in. Oh, good read. Italy with the corner, there first. Neymar goes short. Kimmich. Solid defending, refused to be out-muscled. Oh, that's a foul, free kick's been given. The attendance for this match was 70,987. Neymar. Xiao Cancelo. Out for a throw. Substitution. And it's Cancelo. It's going to be another throw. Kimmich. Some really good ball movement. That's tidy. Alexander-Arnold has it in a wide position. And that's been levered clear. Nicked it back promptly. 
And that's the end of that. It all started well enough. Mbappe! And that would have been game, set and match. Well, for me, he seems to be playing with a lot more zest now. He does look the most likely to grab that second goal cushion. Substitution for Italy, number nine, Neymar. Both sides then taking number this chance 10. to turn to their benches. Coming on the field, number 42, number 66. And that has Ronaldinho. left him in a heap. Substitution in progress. Keep calm and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. He's got away. Italy surely have to be commended for their drive and desire. Most teams would be taking the easier defensive route by now. Done delicately. I thought it was going to happen then. How many more chances can they realistically expect now? There will be five minutes at a time. Now, who's going to be first to this? Yeah, they were looking for a counter-attack. And it's Kennedy. Five minutes to add. João Cancelo. Now it's Mbappe. Oh, that's a key interception. Raul Moro. They want to be quick here, it's breakaway time. Played out towards the right wing. And that is it, the referee has seen it off. Terrific contest, it really might have tipped either way. The margins were tiny, just a goal in it, but that was enough. Rice picking up the man of the match award, and no and surprise there. Today, that would sum up what we've witnessed, Jim. Yeah, clean sheets and hard grind will help you go places.